Hello friends, uh, today I'm going to show you how to prepare the climate data for CMH uh, YT software. So, uh, follow it. Put it as in this folder. Uh, <coughs> so, um, here you have two uh, variables. Temperature and rain for crop or precipitation. Okay. Therefore, first uh, first of all, let me show you how to prepare the data for uh, temperature, uh, precipitation amount. Okay. So uh, first, this one is a file location, uh, location file. This one is uh, the data. So let me open location file. So uh, I have uh, one page station and I represent it by ID, that's one. If you have one well, more, you can uh, add. So uh, the, the file name is this one, B01234, and this is a much lower than long to the solar <coughs> elevation. So uh, after we prepare uh, the data, the location file in this way, we have to first save in the CSV uh, format, okay? To do that, go to File, <coughs> Save as, Browse, go to uh, this, then Save as Type, Open, and CSV, CSV, comma, delimited, okay? Click on that, and I will browse to uh, the folder. I uh, have to save, save, okay, now I can close this one, and this one is the uh, precipitation data, I will open, okay, this one is the data which starts from 1976, and uh, it is up to 2020, okay, therefore, once precipitation, can delete this one and delete and be reminded it starts from 1976. Okay, and, uh, delete. Okay, now uh, this one is uh, in the uh, therefore I have to change into a CSV format again. File, save as, browse, and again change this one to. CSV format, click on that, and I will uh, save in mm, tutorial, save. Now you um, can um, delete and uh, close one, and <coughs> what's left temperature? Therefore, first of all, let me open the uh, location file. Okay, we want location file for the temperature. Therefore, uh, the name of the uh, field is right? 0134 and they have equal uh, coordinates and elevation with the uh, uh, precipitation, uh, precipitation. Okay, therefore, uh, after we prepare uh, this location file this uh, way, we have to save it. In CSV uh, file, okay. Browse. Do I have to change this one to CSV, comma, delimited. Open my collection on that. Text the uh, desktop, tutorial, and save. Okay. You have changed it now. You can close. It was left the data, the, the data of temperature. Open this one. And now, uh, this one is the data temperature. <coughs> Task data, maximum and minimum temperature, okay? Post maximum and minimum, tem minimum temperature. So, one maximum temperature, this one is minimum temperature. Therefore, uh, this one is not important. Okay. I can, this one is the starting data, okay? 1976.
as important. This for level. Now we have to uh, save this one and save SV. For now, save as. Browse. Have to change this format. CSV. Then tutorial. Here. I will save it in this uh, folder. Therefore, save it. Now I can close. Okay. Therefore, all the all data are saved in this folder. Therefore, I open. Then, first of all, <coughs> this one is not. I will check view and file name extension. First of all, I have to check uh, this one. Okay, to see if there is this uh, extension, we have to check this box. Okay, now uh, this one is what? CSV uh, uh, format. Therefore, we have to convert this CSV format into what? Text format. Therefore, to do that, click on this and I click rename. Okay, therefore. I will replace this one by txt. It in the Okay, so this one is text. Okay, I will open. Okay, and this one is the location file. Location file. <coughs> I renamed this is my uh, the location file loads uh, prepared. Okay. I will do uh, for all in the same way. Precipitation, uh, <coughs> where is precipitation? This one, this is the file. I click on this, rename, then this one to txt. Txt, hit enter. Yes, okay, to change it. And again for temperature, uh, the one is temperature, this is the file. I click on this, rename. Replace this one with txt, hit enter, yes, okay, it was converted, now what's left, the data of temperature, this one, okay, I click on this, rename, txt, hit enter, click on, yes, okay, now we have, uh, both uh, temperature and uh, precipitation location file as well as data therefore now <coughs> we have to uh, uh, adjust this one precipitation temperature data open this one therefore here one here there, there is only a data okay but there are no uh, any here therefore first we have to write the starting rate, okay? The starting rate must be written at the top of this data, okay? To do that, by clicking here, hit enter, okay? Then, by returning at the top of the data, we have to write what? Starting here, 19, but 76. Then, first month, 0, 1. And today, zero one. Okay, this one is the first year, and this one is the first month, and the first day. Okay, January first. Then, after we read, after we write in this way, we have to go to file and save. Okay, now choose a uh, adjusted. And again, I have to do the same uh, the same thing for temperature. Open that, and okay, uh, this one is maximum temperature, and this one is minimum temperature, and they are separated by comma. Therefore, by clicking here behind the first data, hit enter. Okay, now come back and to write again the starting grid. One nine seven six. Okay. 0, 1, months, 0, 1, day. Okay, so uh, starting date is 1976, year 
first month that is January first day okay now you can save it go to the to file file save okay <coughs> now we are finished have you left now uh, let's open the precipitation okay precipitation location to find what location file and this one and this one is the location file okay location file and this one is the data the data therefore the name under this uh, field and the name of the data must be similar they must be similar okay what's the name of the field the name of this field, this field is what p zero one two three four this one okay this one is field name is field and this value is p zero one two three four okay this this name must be the same with or similar with this is the name of the data okay therefore I have to write this uh, data name is this okay so let's uncheck this one the file extension now click on this and p zero one two three four okay p zero p zero one two three four but it is one capital letter, therefore I have to uh, change again. I click on this, rename, therefore this piece one capital letter. Enter. So now you can check this value, the name and the name are similar. Okay, P0134, P0134. Therefore, now if you load the, the data into the same HD, uh, same match file uh, uh, software or model, there is no problem. Cannot uh, cannot be fed to any problem or any error. Okay. Now, can uh, prepare the precipitation in this way. Okay. Now, the left wrist temperature. First, uh, this one is a location file for temperature. Okay, this name is what? The field name is T01234. Okay, therefore, I will open the data. The temperature uh, data is this one. Okay, uh, this one is the data. So, uh, by opening the location file for temperature, this one and So, uh, this, name must, this name must be similar with this name, okay? So, I will click on this name, <coughs> temperature, and I have to convert to T0, 1, 2, 3, 4, okay? Hit enter. Okay, let's see. Okay, the data. This name is similar with this name, okay? T0124, T0124. Therefore, in this way, we can prepare the data for the image wide software in order to uh, compute both transformation and extraction. Okay? Now, the data is ready for. Uh, Cmh yd to do extraction as well as a mass correction. Therefore, we uh, can prepare climate data, any climate data. It can be ready for uh, temperature to uh, compute the climate data, both extraction and mass uh, correction. So I think this video is very a uh, important for you uh, for your time thank you very much goodbye